okay hello guys and once again welcome back to the channel so i got confused with the last update regarding the workshop and the design mode uh there were often times wherein all my work uh, disappeared and i was progressing quite a lot and it disappeared okay so i did find out that the best way to actually uh do your work is do some initial work in your actual housing system Afterwards, you can click on the design mode and you can import your local data. This way, all your work will be saved. Once you're working on this location, you just need to click import the local data in order to load the things that you are currently working on. And this should be the house that I'm currently working on. So welcome. So this house is my eco-friendly house. So there are plants all over the place. Uh, it's not finished yet, but it can now be uploaded and people can now download uh, this house as well. So this house was based on the Parasite House. On, yes, it was a bit based on the Parasite House or maybe overall it was based. So this is the entrance for, or this is the main entrance for the house. So once you enter or once you download this game, you have the chance to decorate this location. You can put different um, decors, plants, or whatever you would like. So upon entering, you should be welcomed by the glass panels here and here. Okay, so one of the panels is actually missing. So let's fix that right now. So there should have been a window here. Okay, it seems the wall has been bug bugged or glitched out again. So my only option would be to delete. Or your only option would be to delete if you do use this home. And I would actually recommend that you do. It's actually a beautifully made home. <laughs> okay, so let me just put the design so you should know how it should look like. So there should be a window here on this side as well. So this would be like entering or this should look like a glass panel before entering the main house. Once you enter the main house, uh, this would be the living room. So we have a couch here and a few tables in the center mantle. We also have a panel here. You can put decorations on this side if you want. However, I chose not to. So most of my decorations are on the other side. So we have a combination of two couches, which I did use a glitch on, including the three tables here, which is actually also glitched. So most of the decorations are here. And the paint on this wall was actually removed. So let's repaint this wall with blue. I chose blue because not all of the paint are actually working well with what I was envisioning for this house. But if you do download this house or use this house, once I upload it in a few, you can definitely use any wallpaper you want that would work for you. And I wish and I know that other players are thinking that uh, Dragon Raja should really invest more pixel arts on the game, on the housing system. Um, there would come a point where in most of the things you do in-game are actually getting a bit boring. So it's getting kind of repetitive. So the housing system is actually one of those things that you can use or do in order to pass by time so this is the staircase for the second floor and from what you can see here we have some cabinets here and i placed two mirrors in order to show the staircase going up okay so now we are entering the bar so we have a mini bar here so we have the wine cabinets or liquor cabinets and we have some counter tables here on the set on the side afterwards we have the dining area here we have a television there and an aquarium here and some windows going on the outside. You can plant different trees. The pink trees would be good if you do place them outside. Uh, for example, let's try to do so right now. Yep, 
let's click on outdoors and select this pink one let's place it a bit far not touching the walls and this one as well okay there we go so that would how your dining room would look like and it actually looks really really good okay so this would be our kitchen with the floating coffee maker i'm not sure what's going on but i guess the table or the counter table i placed here is not jiving with the decorations on top but that's okay so if you're coming from the bar you should be able to immediately see the kitchen it's with windows so to make it more look more open so we have a book, bookcase here i was planning on using some wine cabinets here but it wasn't big enough for the design that i was hoping for so i decided to put the bookcase here let's just say that these are made up of cookbook recipes that you can actually use for cooking Okay, so let me just cover up oops, a place that wasn't painted earlier. Okay, so this would be your kitchen. And we have some wine or cooking cabinet here as well. And this is where our open bathroom is actually located with a, within a hidden door. Or I would have considered as a hidden door. So once you enter... This should be a small bathroom located here. Okay, so there should be a small bathroom located here with some bat a tub and some toilet seats. The window should be overlooking some trees as well on that location, but as you can see the door is blocking the view from the window. Let me just fix that in a few. So the best way would be to re oops not that one be to click on the door and reverse how the door is open. So now you can see that you can actually view the outside of the house as well. Not everything is painted yet, so I'm just giving you a browse over. So I've been working on this house for a day now or a few hours now. A few hours uh, for a few days now so once you go up this will be the staircase on the second floor so once you go up you will immediately be bombarded with a hallway so we have a hallway here and we have a hallway here with a very large open window and our third floor staircase so if you proceed on this small hallway there should be a room here so this is one of the hidden rooms with an open window as well and you can see the trees outside it's actually a very good combination so you can place your furnitures here and once you enter here there should be a small oops okay okay i went out the wrong way uh there should be a bathroom here on the end okay here we go so there's a shared bathroom here that will lead you on the other room as well so it's a double locked door if you're familiar with uh, bathrooms or comfort rooms well bathrooms wherein it's shared by two rooms but you can actually lock it from the inside so this would be that kind of setup so this is the entrance to the other room or the actual entrance if I say so myself we also have a cabinet here wherein we have some of the decorations that we can get on the gacha machine okay so let's enter the next room so this is one of the room it's a pink room so this room is actually quite larger it can be considered as the second monster's bedroom it has its own bathroom as well which is located here i'm going to be showing the floor plan in a few Okay, so that's the staircase going up to the second floor. This is one of our master's bedroom, or let's say the your partner's bedroom, if you want to treat it as that way. We have here the first room and the second room. This is the first room that we entered earlier. This is the master's bedroom, and this is the room that we are going to 
enter right now so we actually have a lot of rooms if you use this house we also have uh, an area here or a small entertainment area on the second floor which is a lot smaller compared with the big one on the first floor okay so this is one of our mini hallways so once you enter you will be bombarded with some sculptures and other displays that you can place down we also have a lunch or a waiting area here and here which is also good for viewing the outside of the house and we have trees that is located on the second floor as well as i mentioned we're trying to make an eco-friendly house and this is the room that we haven't entered earlier so it has windows as well it can view the trees from the outside which makes it look elegant and quite nice okay so now let's visit the third floor okay as mentioned on the staircase i placed windows in order to have a view of the staircase it's actually quite an elegant design if i say so myself and it actually does really look good okay so this is the third floor the third floor is actually the open bedroom that i'm quite fond of i haven't made any divisions in the room as of yet but once you download or use this house you can definitely make different divisions that you want we have a window here that's open for collectibles if you have a lot of collectible items this is very this is a very good location in order to place them you can use the brown cabinets you can form a u table here and place all your decorations around surrounding the window which is a good background okay so far this is the window from the front and this would be the master's bath so the master's bath is not that large but it's actually very very spacious I don't like very spacious bathrooms but we have no choice for the moment you can actually place the hot tubs here it would fit I haven't unlocked them yet so I wasn't able to place one but if you do you definitely can okay so let's view the floor plan for the third floor so this is the floor plan for the third floor as I mentioned not everything is painted yet you have the chance to do so as I do not want to do everything on my own and it would be best if you download this or use it but you can actually have a lot of things to do okay so this is the third floor now this is the second floor this is my favorite place on the second floor and we have the pink room for your bond mate you can change the colors depending if you're a female owner or a male owner okay so next as mentioned this is the hallway so this is the hallway here up until here this is the entrance for this room this is the shared bath so room one and room two will have a shared bath here and the uh, master's bedroom a will have its own bath here with the window so you can explore any designs that you want now on the first floor it's a bit complicated we have a lounge area here you can design with chairs some sculptures and once you enter here you can also place a few decorations on this side of the wall and on this side of the wall now on this part i made a bar counter but on this part you can also make a small entertainment room if you want you can place billiard tables or etc you can also place uh, gym equipment if you want but not really my style so this is one of the hidden rooms that you can actually use you can either place a door here have this as a bathroom or any kind of room or just leave it as is as this is as mentioned a hidden room this is one of the second hidden room that we have you can have this updated so depending on what design you want you have extra rooms that you can actually use now this is the kitchen and this is the bed and this is our entertainment and living room it's actually quite very large you can place different instruments here if you want and we have another hidden room here depending on the design that you are hoping for so this is my eco house so we're probably going to place more 
plants here or trees that are colorful to enhance the beauty of uh, viewing the outside when you're inside the house okay guys so this is a brief preview of the house built including the floor plan and some designs that you can actually use so i hope you guys like it and i hope you recommend this uh, house once i do upload it in a few minutes and for those in the global or c server uh, you can you won't be able to download this house as of now uh, i think but you can definitely copy it uh, as i have shown the floor plan you can just pause the video and copy the floor plan exactly as it is okay guys so thanks for watching i hope you continue supporting the channel and my housing builds and i hope you do enjoy everything that we do here and once again thanks for watching